Greetings, Gemini. Welcome to your reading for the time period of August 6th to the 18th, 2018. I am using legacy tarot cards. That's what they look like there, okay? So let's begin with your reading to see what energies come through for you for this time period. Gemini. All right, Gemini, 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 rising. I guess I'm on a lake already, so let me just, all right. Something's going on with a by a lake for you, okay? Gemini, Gemini. I'm sorry, it's a little dark in here, but I can't, I don't have another light. <laughs> okay, Gemini, let's see. <laughs> All right. You have the Eight of Pentacles underneath. Um, you're working hard. You may be working hard, but I also get sweating. Um, you could be having sex. It, I mean, I mean, you could be having sex, yes, with a. Uh, uh, um, I guess something about African. Like that just came to me just now. So, I don't know. You you could be. I know with an African. I don't know what the deal is. Or you're like you're having. Like, you could just be having sex. Period. Or um, you're having sex, but you're like sweating a lot, and maybe or maybe you just perspire a lot. Um, there's something's also going on here with drinking a, a lot of water and needing to drink a lot of water and to keep yourself hydrated. So if you're li literally like having sex or um, maybe you want to drink more water or you do, are you working out, you may be working out. You're trying to, there's something going on here with eating more carbs or like gaining muscles. So maybe something's going on, like maybe your arms are, your arms or legs or something is, um, um, something's going on with you being able to carry somebody either being able to carry them or like to hold or lift heavy things. So what could be a person, I mean, or pull someone, like maybe, maybe you want some of the sex, something that's going on here with sexual, being sexually enticive and entice, enticive, enticing, sexually enticing with this energy. So you could be dealing with earth signs. Like you may be, um, they get smacking. You may be, like, it could be a sex act. Like maybe you're smacking ass, um, whatever you're doing with that energy. You're, you're, there's a lot of sex. You're either having a lot of sex period, or you're having a lot of sex with earth signs. Something is also good. It could be good sex. Like maybe, um, maybe it's the best you've ever had. And it could be with an earth sign energy. Maybe you're saying that. Um, but I also get, I get not the cancer. So this could be a situation here where you, you, you've had sex with a cancerian energy before, male or female, whatever. You could have had sex with those energies before, but maybe they, maybe they weren't very good. Something is going on here with trying different like races of people. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe you are like experimenting with sleeping with you know if you maybe you're a black guy and maybe you're experiencing sleeping with a like with a white woman or a systematic woman or maybe you're a, um maybe you're a black woman and you want to experience sleeping with a black man um, with a white man or or uh, a european man or whatever if you want to experience or whatever the situation is or you're a white man and you want to experience sleeping with a black woman or you're a mixed man whatever it is um there's a change so you're working hard you, you could be working hard in somebody it's, there's a lot of sexual energy here, like your sacral chakra. Um, there's a lot of sexual energy, or you, or you're thinking, like you, you're thinking about doing this to someone. But there's a you. There's this feeling where you, you either live with an earth sign, or you know where they live. Like you know where someone lives, or you know the person that they live with with this energy. Um, and maybe that's why you. I don't know. You're trying to figure out, like, follow them, or you're trying to get an invitation to come see them, vice versa, with this kind of element. Um, there's a, you're not going to let somebody go. So either sexually, um, or literally you're not going to let them go. They may think that you're, they may think that you're letting them go, you know, but I guess I'm like a Leo, like maybe you feel, maybe like the earth sign energy feels that, that you're, you're involved. If you're involved with some fire sign or you're involved with a Leo, whatever, maybe they feel like you're very involved with a Leo and you're not going to leave a Leo for them or, um, 
but I guess it's about side hustles. So this could be like maybe you're trying to offer someone a side hustle or like a really cool way how they, how they can make money. That could be why you're you're working hard. Like with a could be working hard with a Leo. Maybe you and a Leo like you operate a side hustle or you both have a side hustle with this energy here. Um, there's a letting go of one. So you could be letting go of one person. It could be a Leo or I get Capricorn. You could you're either letting go of a Leo or you're letting go of a Capricorn um, with this energy. So I, you have serious like a two of swords. You have a choice to make, but is it keeping someone around kind of vibe? So you're you're trying to keep either one of those energies. You're trying to keep the it could be both of them. You're trying to keep those energies around. But I get they're, they're good housemates to you. So those energies are really good housemates. Like you you like living with them. Um, but they're they're also very fun. But I get orgies. So maybe you're inviting these energies to like like orgies, like, you know, like sex parties and those kind of things, like swinging parties and that kind of stuff. Like maybe you're inviting those energy, they're inviting those energies to the, there's a Leo that's already familiar with that, but the Capricorn is not. So maybe that's why that like, you want to invite someone to that. But I, I get I'm going to spend all my time with you. So if it's an orgy or like some type of sex situation, like, I don't know, it's kind of interesting. It, it could be an outing, it could be a venue, like a party or whatever. You, somebody thinks that you're going to like diverge your um, diverge your attention away from them, but you're not going to do that or you are. Um, or you're going to spend a lot of time with them at a party, at a venue, at a whatever it is that you're trying to do with this kind of energy. So it could be like a sex or open. I don't know. It's kind of weird. It could be like a open sex situation where that like, you're 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 saying to someone you know i'm gonna spend you could be saying that to a leo you know i'm gonna i'm not gonna let you go like i'm not gonna let you go you know i'm not gonna let you go or it's a, it's a capricorn or some earth sign energy you're not gonna let somebody go with that kind of feeling nine of cups nine of cups energy for what you're asking um it's i guess it's something too tight so <laughs> Don't get me started here. You're saying there's something too tight. So it could be somebody's vaginal area. Like maybe somebody is saying to you, maybe something hurts. Maybe it's tight. You know, there's something going on here with lube and loosening up those kind of areas with the Knight of Cups. It could be somebody's butthole with the Knight of Cups energy being here. It could be those parts of the body, but it's tight. Or you're maybe you're wearing something that's tight. It could be tight pants, tight shirt. And me, your partner's trying to understand why you're dressing so tight. This could be like, um, maybe you're kind of like gender neutral. Like maybe you believe in wearing like gender gender neutral kind of outfits with a Knight of Cups. This could be a first date that you're going on, and and maybe somebody is is immediately like they're judging judging what you have on on a first date. If you're having sex on someone like a one night stand, like maybe somebody like you you're you're judging somebody by saying that they're tight or they're saying that you're tight. Or something hurts with a Knight of Cups. You know, I can go get lube. Whatever situation is it's not gonna hurt anymore. Something is also torn, so it could be clothes, like or or somebody's like, <laughs> but I guess somebody's marriage. Somebody's marriage is also torn, so it could be you. Maybe you, maybe you're married to someone. It could be the earth sign or the fire sign that you could be tied to them. But maybe you feel, maybe you, maybe you. I, I get decided to go with an earth sign. Like you decided to stay with an earth sign. There's another element that they're responsible for why your marriage is torn like you could be you could be responsible for why someone's marriage i get the earth sign you're responsible for why an earth sign energy's marriage is torn but it has to do with an invitation or some type of party or some type of sex act that you're, you're trying to do with somebody or you did with someone with the knight of cups like i didn't do it yet so you didn't do it yet whatever it is could be a sex act but whatever whatever sex act that somebody's going going to do with you like whatever sex act they're going to do with you, it's, it's going to be the end of their marriage or it's going to be an end of yours with the Knight of Cups energy being here because something is going to come out or your feelings or something's going to be revealed of what you're trying to do or what they're trying to do with the Knight of Cups energy being here. But there's an I'm going to have you kind of vibe. So you could be you could be saying that to a Leo. Like maybe you're trying to, there's, something's revoked with a Leo. Like someone's going, you love a Leo. You love a Leo with all your heart. Like you really love, but somebody, somebody, I get ch keep cheating. Like there's a Leo that keeps cheating on you. Something is different about them. So either it's their smell or their look or th the way they smile is something is about something. The way they move is really different. Somebody has been lying about something. So it could be travels that maybe your boyfriend or girlfriend that they've been taking. Some fire sign that they've been taking and, and but they're lying about these travels. And they're going to see like they're like they're other man, they're other woman with the Knight of Cups, or it's if that is happening to you. But I get this also that that's also happening to your friend. But it could be the Capricorn. 
female Capricorn female is also happening to them. So maybe you're maybe you're a guy and they're the girl and maybe you have remorse for each other but you're cheating partners. So you're you're getting you're you're get you're trying to figure out ways to get together to sleep with each other to get back at your both of your partners with the Knight of Cups secret lover stuff. Hmm, that's still happening. But something has not it's the it's it's it has been in a planning process. Like nobody has made moves to do that yet with the Knight of Cups energy being here. But the, you're trying to fit. You're like, I'm going to do it. You're going to do it. You know, you're going to do it. Like nothing is going to get in your way this time with the Knight of Cups energy being here. Nothing is going to get in your way at this time. But I guess in the month, if the Leo, if the Leo leaves, like you may be waiting for a Leo like energy to leave the house, you know, leave the car. Maybe 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 you're in the car with a Leo and you're waiting for them to get out and you're gonna drive to somebody else's place, or maybe they're in the car and they're they're waiting for you to get out and and they're about to you're using the intuition that they're about to go drive to somebody's place. But I think that's where their children are. So they're driving like your partner or somebody you have a friend, whoever, a coworker. You are using the intuition that you're you this this partner that you have. They're about to get out of the car and they're about to go see their kids or pick up their kids or go be with their kids. But I get their secret lover. So either you're, you have a secret lover that you're dropping off your the, your partner and you're going to see your secret lover or your partner is doing that with you. But I get the earth sign. The earth, the earth sign is either like they're a secret. They could be either a secret partner or they're your main partner and you're going to see a side person. This is, I get, this is why someone does not pick you up or this is why you don't pick up somebody from somewhere. Because you're spending time, I get your side woman, your side woman, side dude. You're spending time, I get something about a cancer. You're spending time with a cancerian energy. That's who That's who you're cheating on somebody with. Hmm. Or an earth sign. The earth sign is also a marital partner, external from you. But I get you also, I get you also want to hit that. Like you, you also want to hit an earth sign or you have been hitting them. This could be actually physically, like maybe you're starting to be, because you don't want to be with somebody anymore. Like that could be the Capricorn, whatever you're starting to either physically hit or abuse someone, or maybe you're hearing that that's happening to them, or you're responsible for that. You're responsible for hit, hitting somebody. So what's uh, hitting them or hitting whatever? You could have been hitting on them, or they could have been hitting on you with the Knight of Cups energy being here, or or you hit them, and maybe I get they're running, they're they're running to they they keep running to I get another Capricorn like you're tied to a Capricorn that's being abused either you're abusing them, and they're running to the, they're running to another Capricorn or they're running to some friends because you're doing that to them, but they're not telling the friend that with the Knight of Cups. Somebody's trying to paint a picture of a beautiful house. So you could be the one that's trying to paint a beautiful picture with you and a Leo. Like maybe something's going on. If I get getting smacked around with a Leo, like maybe a Leo is smacking you around. Or you, I don't know, are you doing that to them with the Knight of Cups? But if you're doing that to them, it's because of a Cancerian energy with the Knight of Cups. It's because of a Cancer. But if it's an Earth sign, like a Capricorn energy, but either it's happening external or you're responsible for slapping them around and they're running to their friends. Or, or, or they consider you to be like a friend and they're running to you. This is what's happening in my marriage. This is what my, I get a Sag. This is what's happening between me and a Sag. It could be abuse, lies. It's like Capricorn energy is dealing with a Sagittarius energy that's lying to them. You're aware of that. But it's, I want to help. Like you want to help those energies. Like you want to help. Like that's why I said you're responsible for why a marriage is broken. Or somebody's responsible for why somebody's marriage is broken. So it's either because they've been getting beaten and hitting on, they're, somebody's trying to lie about secret children and and, and getting out the car and going to see, see lovers, and that's why you're not getting picked up from the damn bus bus stop or the train stop or an airport. You're like, why am I being why am I getting less hanging at an airport? You could have just flown in somewhere, or someone could have just flown in somewhere. And you're like, why are they taking so long? They're trying to make up, they're, or they're trying to say that, oh, I was at the grocery store, or I was doing this, that, and the third. When you, like, they, they were locking lips with their partner, either you were or they were, with this kind of energy. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Positive energy has the seven of swords. I get break up. I get Leo. Like you, you, you may be making. It's because of this cancer. Like it's because it could be cancer. Like maybe like an actual cancer that's growing in somebody's body. Like maybe something's going on with that. Or it's the sign of cancer is causing you to break up with a Leo, or maybe contemplate breaking up with a Leo with seven of swords, or you're making plans to leave a Leo-like energy. Something is something is better about a Capricorn. So it could be like I don't know. It could be like the something going on with body. Like it could be somebody's body type. 
maybe somebody's body type is better. You, you're saying that somebody's body type is better or Cancerian energy. Maybe a Cancerian energy's body type is better. But a Cancerian energy is too hands-on. They could be the ones that are rushing in. And they want sex. Like There's a Cancerian energy that wants sex really, really bad. Maybe their body is good looking. Maybe it's I don't. Know, maybe it's not attractive to you or something. Maybe somebody has, doesn't have a behind or no boobs or, or not big enough lips or whatever stupid sh situation that is there. Whatever it is, or that's why you're ignoring them or the intuitive. Like, you're looking at somebody new. Okay, this you know what this feels like. You mean if you're tied, to, you're tied to a Leo or a Capricorn, some Earth sign, or you're tied to fire sign energy, Leo energy. You're tied to them. This Cancerian energy is like this could be their third wheel, and like they're they're a third wheel to, to to two women that you really really like. You may just have sex with this person for the fun of it. You're not really emotionally tied to this energy, but they're trying to be. But something's going on with their looks. Like maybe they're not very good looking. They're not very attractive. But a Capricorn energy is like seven of swords. Like you're saying that. Something is blatant about that. Like you're blatantly saying that. Or maybe a Capricorn energy is blatantly revealing something about you. <laughs> but I guess they didn't mean to. Like a Capricorn energy is blatantly revealing something about you, but they don't mean to do that. You think maybe you think that they do. But I guess that's why, that's, like I said, that's why marriage is broken up or that's why a Leo is trying to leave you or that's why a Leo is cheating. A Leo, a Leo intuitively feels like you want to be with somebody. But it's like, I don't want kids yet. Like you, you may be trying to, this seven of swords, you're planning to give an emotional offer to a Leo that they're not ready to have kids yet. I'm not ready. They're, they're not ready. You're, you're trying to give them, set up appointments for them to figure out ways how they could get pregnant. Somebody doesn't want to mess with their figure. You don't, they don't, some fire sign that you're dealing with. If it's a job, you know what? You could be making plans to leave a job, move to a job, but something hurts with a job. So it could be hurtful things that people are saying to you in a job. But I also get in a home environment. So somebody could be saying something hurtful about you or to you in a home environment. That's why I get smacked around and stuff. That's that's why you're leaving. Like you received a, an emotional offer by someone, and you're you're taking them up on their offer, and you're like, I'm leaving you. I'm leaving this place. I'm leaving this job. I can't I can't deal with this emotional drainage anymore, or the abuse anymore, or it's external, and you're hearing about it. Hmm. What's negative about the situation is the seven of pentacles, seven of coins energy here. But again, I need this. I need this life. I need this work. I need this job. But I also get I need this woman. So it could be the earth sign woman that is somebody that you need. I get crutching like you're crutching on them, or they're when you feel like they're a crutch, they're a little bit of a crutch to you. But I get that's why you're sneaking out on them, like or that's why somebody is sneaking out on them because they're a crutch. It's not that they're not good looking or or this that and the third. It's because it's because they don't have any money. It's about lifestyle and status with this energy. Like maybe you're saying to yourself, like maybe if somebody had more money or if they had some going on with looks again, like maybe if somebody had like some type of look to them, could be being fair skin or light skin or, or some type of body type or whatever it is that like you're saying that if somebody had something, then you would treat them better or you would invite them places. That's why you don't spend time with someone. It could be the earth sign. That's why you don't go out with somebody because of the way they look. It's about looks. Mm, but the she's cute. Like maybe you're saying that somebody's cute, but you still don't want to go out with them. You don't want an earth sign energy to be judged by your family or your friends. You don't want them to be judged. But yeah, a Virgo doesn't. A Virgo does not does not all they also don't want somebody to be judged. They 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 are the ones that they they don't want to be judged by your family members or friends. But you're gonna invite someone somewhere anyway. Your seven of swords and the knight of cups from left to right. You're you're gonna invite someone anyway. You're gonna spend some time with earth sign energy anyway. But is it your mother doesn't like so something that, something about your mom. Your mom does not like uh, earth sign energy. There's a female on this card. That's why I said crutch. This energy like they could have been newly homeless or maybe they they're struggling. Like they, they, this woman like she's not very richly dressed. Maybe something's going on with that rich and poor and middle class and high class and, and status and money. Like you want to go spend time with someone that you feel does not have as much as you, vice versa. They also think something crazy of you. If it's an earth sign, they also think something crazy of you as well. Something going on here with like you're being grandiose, like like feel it like walking all over people. Maybe they feel like that's something that you do. You're also tied to them, but they also feel like you should tone that down a little bit. 
But again, that's how they that's how you treat your friends, or that's how they treat uh, that's how they are you are you you could be the one that's treating your friends this way. You're calling someone a friend, they're not really a friend if it's an earth sign, they're not really a friend. You're just calling them off as one, or because they support you. That's why, vice versa. But again, that's not why. That's not the reason why you're calling somebody your friend, or the reason why you're not calling someone your friend, or why you're not hanging out with someone the truth, into why you're not hanging out with someone. Cause you're afraid of judgment with that energy so it could be workplace like maybe you're trying to hang out with someone that you've schemed out and if you feel like somebody's being schemed out of something in some job and you, you want to be nice but they're darker somebody's darker you want to be nice it could be your damn partner that you that you're not you're not trying to have your friends that you you're you're feeling crazy you're a guy is an assigned woman that you that you, you you're losing your mind because of the way they look and you don't want your friends around them because you don't want your friends to make fun of them Right? Even though she's better than them, like even though it could be a she or sign energy, even though she's better looking than them, or it could be her integrity, her reputation is better, his or her reputation is better. I'm gonna hang out with them. There's a lot of low, someone's going with low self esteem, so you may feel like this energy has low self esteem, and they do or they don't, or they think you do, but they they may if you feel that way about them, they may feel that you have insecurity, like they think that you're insecure about not spending time with them. Or about not whatever inviting them somewhere whatever it is but i also get being a mama's boy like maybe they feel that that they, that you let your mother govern everything that you do with them and that's also not right so it could be like a workplace this could be workplace this could feels family to me feels like family has a lot of say friends have a lot of say who you're chilling with or you're you're in between two people you you have a, you're trying to have a choice in between dating or being or having sex with two people but I also get you're, you're sneakily being with an earth sign. You're trying to sneakily be with them. You don't want your mom to know that. You don't want a dad to know that. Vice versa. They don't want they don't want you they don't want um your the, their parents don't want you to do that with them, whatever that means to you. The advice is coming from the page of wands, a younger fire sign, it could be that Leo. I get annoying, like something that is annoying, it could be a kid. This could be a child situation. Maybe, maybe there's a child that is a, 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 that, that is watching your infidelity. That there's a child around that's watching you being watching you cheat on your partner with somebody. There's a, some child. Is they they I get some texts and phone calls. Like maybe they're looking at your phone, or maybe it's just a younger Leo that watches and clocks everything that you're doing. There's a, I know you want to go to her. Like this energy is like I know you want to go to her. You could be saying you or him, him or her. That you could be saying that to this younger uh, Leo-like energy, some younger fire sign. You're saying that I, I know you want to go to him or her. They're saying I know you want to go to him or her. Something's going on with texting. Like you're texting somebody, or they see you texting someone, or writing them on on social media, Facebook, Instagram, text messages. The earth sign. Like you're doing that to an earth sign. That like, repeatedly you're doing that, and they're like, I know. Just go. Just go. Somebody's more nurturing, so this this element could be more nurturing. But even though they're on the negative side, they're the reason into why something is 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 uh, a house is, is is faulty with the page of wands, or it's a kid. Maybe I get running around. There's there's a kid that run, runs around and they see everything. But I get that's my friend. Like maybe you're trying to tell like, your son. You're trying to tell your son that that some woman that's coming into a house is a friend, but you really have feelings for them. Or it's your wife's friends that it's your wife's wife's friend that you have feelings for and that you I get that you slept with. Your wife's friend, if you're married, your your wife's you're telling your son that that your wife's friend that your wife's friend is um that is is your friend and but you really slept with them. Wow, you slept with them. You slept with them. Seven of swords. See, you you could be te oh this is crazy you could be texting like your side woman side dude right right where right right when and where your partner's your partner is and they see that page of wands right the Capricorn the Capricorn sees that or the Leo sees that they see it with the with the page of wands and they see it but I get that's why they're running to their friends all the time but I get you have feelings for but somebody's friends too. So it could be your partner's friends. Maybe you have feelings for your partner's friends. But it's like a, when your part somebody's friends, like you, you got feelings for your wife's friends, your your boyfriend's friends. You got feelings for them. 
but you're not telling your, your wife or your boyfriend your your part you're not telling your partner that they're like why are you looking so shady about it just just tell me that you like him or her like why are you being shady about it page of wants there's nosy kids or a nosy younger fire sign energy that they see who you're texting they see who you want to be with or maybe you're clocking them they are in the advice and that's why that that the advice is being given to you into they're telling you just go this could be a friend this could be a younger fire sign friend that you confide in right that your wife doesn't know about your wife or your husband your partner does not know about some younger fire sign friend that you've been getting advice from and to leave in somebody because they're broke like maybe somebody's broke or not hanging out with somebody because they're broke they don't have any money whatever damn most recent issue has the two of wands you need patience to deal with fire signs but i guess i'm up there breaking maybe they're starting to break things or maybe they're breaking out this could be skin stuff maybe somebody's breaking out and hives could be like going that's why you want the energy to go to the doctor but it's a who did you sleep with like maybe you're breaking out maybe you slept with someone and you're start. i get the cancer maybe you slept with someone or you kiss somebody and you're starting to break out in hives or or um what do you call it herpes or some type of shit like that with the two of wands i don't want to kiss you you know somebody's cheating damn i don't want to kiss you this could be a situation here where your partner is breaking out in something around their lips or or somewhere personal and 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 it's like and it's like you you got them just in time and you're like I'm not going to kiss you or put my mouth down there you crazy with the two of wands There's a smell also this could be like smell like sex There's a smell I'm going to meet somebody who has a smell I'm meet somebody who has a smell in some area their body Hmm very interesting. Two of Wands. They know that you've been sleeping around. Or you're doing that. Or you know that they're doing that. I'm not kissing you. I'm not hugging you. I'm not touching you there. I'm not kissing you there. I'm not putting my mouth there. Hmm. Interesting. So if this is a job situation, if this is anything having to do with a damn job, it doesn't really feel like job. It feels more so like relationships and personal relations and the relations yes and cheating and this that and the third and sleeping around and catching things through sleeping around two of wands energy and, and or you seeing or you liking like your partner's friends vice versa they like your friends hmm interesting shit boy oh <sighs> the answer is coming from the page of cups younger water sign i was getting that cancer or these could be two kids this could be two boys or a boy and a girl or two girls it's gonna be kids that see everything, or it's a younger, or it's a younger. Um, but I get I don't want my kids around this. You don't want your kids around something that's happening in your home. So maybe you're trying to get them out of the house. You could be trying to get your kids out of the house, or somebody's kid out of the house, so they won't see or hear something. That's why you're introducing your. That's why I said son. You're you're telling your son that 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 is my um that that's that she's a friend. Or you, you, you're trying to act like you don't have feelings for somebody, but you do. Wow. Inviting someone over, not hanging out with someone because of their status, looks. Or it's not looks, or it's just because they don't have any money, or you don't want their, your friends making fun of them. There's a Leo-like energy that does not care about what you're, that you have kids with someone, or you impregnated somebody, or you slept with someone, you caught something, vice versa. There's a Leo energy that they don't care. Two of wands, page of, page of wands. They don't care. There's a do what you want with a Leo with some fire sign. There's a, there's a do what you want. So it could be your, it could be like a sibling that you're trying to get advice from, a younger sibling that you're trying to get advice from, into leaving someone, working with somebody. This could be a job. This would be a job where someone's going with a sex accusation in a job. A sex accusation in a job. That's what that could also be what's coming out here with this energy. The environment has the nine of swords, nine of swords energy. But as I need help, nine of swords is kind of like you're not getting any sleep, insomnia. You you may think that you need help with something, or you it, it swords represent your mind that like maybe you need help. Maybe somebody's saying you need help. If I get Leo, there's a Leo, Leo or Libra. Those energies think that you need help for some reason with something that you're doing or you're trying to do, or because you like somebody. But I also get because you can't stop doing something, something that you're continuously doing. Like there's energies that feel like you need help because you can't stop doing it, whatever that is. 
cheating, could be cheating or lying, could be like pathological lying mm, that you're doing or fire sign energy is doing. Well, trying to get somebody to stop doing that. It could be in front of, I, I did say someone was pretending to go places, but they get out the car so I could go see my man or woman, my other man or woman, but they're not telling you that. Nine of Swords. Capricorn, whatever a Capricorn is doing, they're the best. So this, because, this could be a situation where you're trying to roll with people that aren't good for you, or you're trying to date or marry or be with people that aren't, they're really not good for you, but there's a Capricorn energy that maybe you're, 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 look, you're not looking at them. You're not trying to look at them, or you are. They're better for you for whatever reason. But you're trying to like, I don't know. It's crazy. Oh my God. Let's see the outcome for Gemini. All right, Gemini. King of Cups. King of Cups energy, this could be you being nurturing or maybe somebody, like somebody screaming at you about you being more nurturing to them. Maybe that's, maybe you're intuitively, maybe that's why you feel like somebody's trying to run out on you. Could be in a job. This could be some type of workplace situation. Maybe you're really hard on someone in a job or they're hard on you in a job or at home, smacked around energy. That's why you're doing shady things or that's why they're doing, maybe somebody's trying to say that you're abusive, but maybe you're not. Someone may be trying to say that you're abusive, but you're not abusive. Vice versa, King of Cups. You're trying to be nurturing, but I also you're trying to you're also trying to get out of your head. Or it's a it's a King of Cups. Some water sign man is 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 the reason. I get that's who your partner has been seeing. If it's a Leo, they've been messing around with this energy, and they're the cause. Nine of Swords, King of Cups. They're the cause into why they're trying. You you may feel like this energy is trying to break up something, your marriage, your life. Your home, I get that you have with a Leo. That this energy is trying to break up your home that you have with a Leo. Could be a woman or a man showed up as a man, or this energy is you. That maybe you need to be more nurturing in a job for some reason. Hmm. Maybe you're too hard on people on somebody in a job, or maybe you're too something's going with being abrasive. Like maybe something's going with being abrasive. Seven of Pentacles, being abrasive with something. Hmm. All right, Gemini, let me know how it works out for you and resonates. Take care. Be well. Bye.